Hey, my name is Robert L. Williams. I am a master electrician in North Texas. I've had a company for well over 35 years. Uh, I love this country. I love what it stands for. I love the flag. I love why we are Americans. Today, my team, the Pittsburgh Steelers, decided that they needed to keep themselves in the locker room while Mr. Villanova went out to salute the flag and to stand for the anthem. All right, this is what I think of that. All my Steeler stuff. This is a $450 leather jacket. Watch me burn it. All my hats, all my sweaters. You know something? We have morals in this country. We stand for this country. My great uncle's bones are lying in the bottom of Pearl Harbor. All right, for this country, for the flag, for your freedom to play in the NFL and to say whatever you want to say, but you do not dis you do not disrespect the flag and the country and the Constitution and why we are here and why we have our freedoms. So watch this stuff burn. Yeah, Super Bowl, right? As if I care. What I care about is this country. What I care about is our freedom. What I care about is everyone's right to be free. And it's all about those stars and stripes. Come on, baby, light. There we go. Yeah, my father was a Marine, my grandfather was in the Army, my uncle was in the Army. Our right. son is in the Army currently. Yeah. And, you're, and you're not going to sing the National Anthem and stand united as a country and disrespect our, our veterans. No, you're not. You're not going to disrespect our country. You're not going to disrespect our flag. You're not going to disrespect each and every veteran who died, who died so that we could stay free and say what we want and believe what we believe. You don't, you've crossed the line. This is a line you guys are unaware of, but you have crossed it. I'm done. Are you done? I love America and I love you. God bless you and I pray that you believe that Jesus Christ died, he was buried and he rose again the third day for your salvation. That's what this country was, was founded on. That and the Torah, the Ten Commandments. Believe it. Embrace it.